welcome back to the channel everyone and uh, today we are still in Cambridge and we are visiting an army reserve centre uh, which is the University or the Cambridge University Royal Naval Unit also known as the URNU and we're in Coldens Lane in a CR1 postcode which is maintainable at the public expense so we're actually on public land uh, we're still in an FRZ because the uh, airport's just over the uh, over the back so I'll cut in some details of uh, uh, Google Maps so you can see what the site looks like from above uh, the commanding officer uh, is Lieutenant Richard George RN the coxswain is CPO Sean Dunley and the senior training officer is Lieutenant Daniel Davis so uh, I'll cut in some more details from the actual uh, from the website Uh, what this is all, uh, all about and uh, let's have a look at what we can see just from, uh, from here so as you can see some uh, army reserve centre Cambridge University office, officers training corps I'll get a little bit closer I'll get across the road Quite a busy road this one. <clears throat> so we've got the railway tracks run just up there. So yeah, Cambridge University. Start again. So Cambridge University Officer Training Corps, Cambridgeshire Army Cadet Force, number two Cromwell Company and Cambridge Detachment. Cambridge University Royal Naval Unit and the 32 Military Intelligence Company, 3 Military Intelligence Battalion. And the Army Reserve uh, Centre, so I'm not going to go past this uh, black gate here. Uh, this, I'd say, is public land that I'm on at the moment, still part of Cromwell Road. Uh, somebody actually trying to get in. So uh, you won't be able to see a lot from uh, from here, I don't think. Let's have a quick look. Over the side. Can't really see much, just a car park. I'm looking over the fence. There is a big lake uh, at the back. Uh, you'll be able to see that from the, uh, the Google map shot. But it looks like a fairly big, uh, big unit. From the uh, when I show you on the maps, and uh, the lake looks uh, amazing. So they probably do a lot of stuff there. So I'm not going to go past these black gates. This is a military site. And. Uh, Filming the sky again, apologies for that. Was it watching what was on the camera? It's only got a four time zoom this camera, so you can't really uh, can't really see much. But when I get uh, my new camera, probably in about a month's time. So it's just not letting this guy in, probably hasn't got the correct uh, pass. So it's just come out. So 
So I've been seen, but I'm on uh, public land at the moment, as far as I'm aware. If I'm not, it's purely accidental. Because there's no sign saying do not cross any barriers, apart from on the actual, uh, apart from on the gate there. That says no unauthorised access, deep water and hazardous areas. The footpath in design does actually change as well as you get to the uh, the black gate. So that's a genuine indicator that it's a change of land. So I wonder if it's like university students that are doing a degree want to get into the uh, the Royal Navy or the military and come here before they uh, go off to somewhere like Sander. Sorry, I'll keep on filming the sky. They're not letting you in? They're not letting you in? Oh, no, Alright. Wait, you forgot your pass? <laughs> sorry? I can't hear you, sorry. I can't hear you. No, no, no. What, what are you here for? I can't hear you. Car's going past. You here for? Oh, fitness. Yeah, I'm. I'm totally unfit. So I foul. So I ain't worth it. <laughs> so generally, is here for a fitness session, fitness test. So it's just waiting to be, uh, to be lit in. If I zoom out, then that way there's less chance of me uh, filming the sky. Uh, I think it's going to be a short video, this one. Uh, there's a camera just on the top of that pole, so I've probably been picked up. But uh, that uh, young lady did see me. We're just talking to this gentleman here. So uh, I will stitch in some more details as to what each of these are. So the 32 Military Intelligence Company and the... Came to University Royal Navy Unit, I'd go straight to there, the number two Cromwell Company. It's got a website on the, uh, the Cromwell Company one, which is uh, campsacf.com, so C A M B S A C F.com. So, yeah, I'm looking over the fence, it's just, I think that's Asda's car park, uh, Sainsbury's car park. So you've got Sainsbury's just through there and that is their, their car park. So it's got nothing to do with, uh, yeah, so you can see the wall going all the way down. So just zoom in. But when you uh, go on Google Maps, you can actually see the size of the, uh, of it here. It's quite, uh, it's quite big. There's actually a fire unit in here as, uh, as well, apparently. There's a massive lake over the back. That looks pretty uh, pretty cool. So they probably, uh, we've been a naval unit, they probably do a lot of stuff on there.
it's got there we are a smoke free site 10 mile an hour speed limit It's only going to be a short one, this one definitely going to be left alone, which is exactly what you want to see. No one's come out. Okay, well, so if you, uh, you like that uh, video, just a little short one, uh, please give it a like, please give it a share. Oh, someone's coming out now, so it might become to this gentleman in. So I've been filming the sky again. Never know they uh, were there for him. I'll just see this gentleman see if he gets let in. Oh, if she's come to speak to me, which is highly unlikely. But you never know. So I'm not going to cross this boundary. So I'm on maximum uh, zoom at the moment, which is times four. <coughs> so he's showing his details, so hopefully she's going to let him in. He's got a, apparently he's got a fitness, uh, fitness test. Good luck with your test. Good luck with your test. Yeah, good luck. Yeah, so she's just ignoring me exactly how it uh, should be, so well done. That's still looking. Walking away. Yep, so uh, well done there to the uh, people that see me there. Didn't uh, didn't engage, just let me go about my lawful business. So, yep, that's a big part. So, uh, well done Cambridge University and the uh, Army Cadet Centre. So, once again, if you like that video, guys, have a please give it a thumbs up, please give it a like, please give it a share. Uh, if you've watched it, uh, please subscribe uh, to the channel. It doesn't cost you anything. Uh, to uh, to subscribe and it uh, it's a big uh, big help and uh, as always uh, everybody have a fantastic day and uh, until the next video bye for now.